Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to the channel for today's video. Today, as you guys can see, we got the rig loaded up with all the toys up on it and we are heading out on this eight day camping trip. So let's go ahead, let's hit the road and let's get to it. All right, now I'm feeling back at home here. We're on the dirt road, you know, my favorite way. Holy shit, this guy's flying. <laughs> Sheesh, buddy. So let's uh, Kirkity cruise down this way and uh, yeah, we'll show you when we end up figuring out uh, if we get to this little river spot and have a nice little chillaxing spot and we'll show you. All right, so we just arrived, pulled up to this absolutely banger spot. Just kind of found it on the side of the road when we were going to the spot where actually we're gonna try and go to. This spot's sick, like there's, let's check this stuff out over here, boys. This is just what's like left over. You got like these stands and stuff to like dry your clothes over there. And then they even left like a little kind of like ghetto homemade table on some sticks. So that's huge bonus, absolutely sick to have that. And then up above in the trees, up over here, there's like a little mini like dirt track. You go rip around, so you get wild up there. This is awesome. All right, so I thought I'd kind of show you guys where we came into. Come ripping down here. Epic, epic little spot. Yeah, buddy. Woo! <laughs> nice little burnt down car, a bunch of a-holes put there. Not cool. Pop over the whoop. Come around in through the mud. Go wide. Pop the front end up. Lean it back. Nice little power wheel. Whoop, whoop! Whoa! Jumping Jimmy stands. We're gonna come down here. Past the wood. Oh, she's tight here. Come in over here. Woohoo! Start sliding in that way. Then you got this absolutely sick spot here. to do a little loopy here. We'll come back here, do a little more drift though. Come down here. It gives you some access down to this river. And then you got this whole sweet spot out here. Awesome, absolutely awesome. Lots of people do some like salmon fishing and stuff out here. And you can come on down over this way. And then we got our absolutely sick spot right here. Aaron is just ripping his dirt bike. As you can see, he is coming down right now. Woohoo! He's going fast and I have my dirt bike here. Yeah, this is awesome. I'm happy with this, boys. Don't you worry, we got a lot more. Oh, ride the berm? Yes, please, sir. Woohoo! We got a lot of epic dirt biking spots coming up. This is not even a dirt biking spot, like really. This is just our first little campground for our trip. And then we got a whole bunch of other spots planned out, and including a couple of, uh... whoa, she's slippery a couple of actual dirt bike parks that we're gonna be heading up to. So I'm super duper stoked on those. All right, let's make our, uh, let's make our way up to this waterfall. Bring Jess along with the ride for us. Let's see if we can pop a wheelie. Whoa! Try again. Now I know, I have no idea if we can actually get to this waterfall or ride to it or what, but I just saw it on the, on the map. So see what we can find, I guess. All right, let's see if we can do this hill climb. <laughs> All right, so we just found this like little trail. We can hear a waterfall down there. Let's see if we can get a view of the waterfall from over here. It seems like I can definitely hear that thing just rage in water. Rage in water, boys. It should be exciting. I wanna see this one. Yeah, you're definitely not taking a dirt bike on this. Holy shit. That is just straight down the hill, boys. I was thinking, are you trying to take a dirt bike in here? No, you make one screw up, you are going 100 feet down into the water. You're going for a swim, boys. And uh, you know what? I'm not in my uh, swimming apparel right now. So, you know, I'm not really ready to. Oh yeah, there's a rope so you can climb up when you
you come back up. So I think I'm gonna throw you guys on my helmet. I'm gonna helmet, helmet back on so I can use these, so I can use these handholds here. This kind of gives you guys a perspective of just how steep this stuff is. Like this stuff is uber steep. Like I'm almost looking up at those trees at the tops, just looking out, that's crazy. Yeah, you're definitely not riding a dirt bike up this. I mean, look at that. Super cool spot. Let's see if we can get onto this knoll and get a better view. Yup, we are starting to see the waterfall. Damn, that's beautiful, boys. How risky is this for getting wet feet? How grippy or slippy? Oh, it's pretty slimy. Man, what an absolute beauty spot. This is so epic. Such a cool little spot to ride the dirt brakes too. Well, that was an absolute blast down at the uh, waterfall. Now we're cruising back to camp. I think it is beer o'clock. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Let's go get some beer, boy. Yeah. Beauty, boys. That is so much fun. So much fun. Yeah, girl. Awesome. <laughs> All right, we just got back from our ride to the waterfall there. We got uh, sipping on some cold beer here. Cheers. I got uh, a Sunsetter pineapple wheat ale. Something new to try out, loving it. And I got a Moosehead Rattler and I thought it was a cider, but it's actually a beer. So it's the Tropical Punch, so. She's drinking beer tonight. Drinking beer. Cheers. Cheers. Out here living our best life, boys. Sitting in the river in our camp chair, swim shorts, little moon chair, kick her back. Ah, hell yes. Now all you need is a beer. Things are just all right. Ain't nothing to sweat out here, boys. Look at this, look at this. Would you, would you just, just look at it? Would you just look at it? Look at that, look at that. Look at that thing too. Look at it. Sheesh. Yeah. Sheesh. Dope boys, sitting in the river, drinking a beer, boys. Don't get much better than that. Hell yeah, brother. Well, we went for an after dinner, after beer ride, and we're here we are somewhere in the middle of I don't know where. We're climbing some sort of mountain at like 8.30 at night. Yeah, my GoPro died. Make sure you guys go down below, click like, click subscribe for more. You're not gonna wanna miss this adventure. Cheers to that. Woo! We'll see you guys in the next see video. <laughs> hey guys, what is up? It's Aaron for the channel. We're back here for another day of our off-roading, dirt biking, kayaking, camping, awesome adventure. It's uh, like eight o'clock in the morning and we're getting after it early. We're on this like super old forest service road and we're trying to see if it, we can find a back road that connects us from where we are camping going north to the next city we're trying to get to. Now we got a long ways to rip up this road and see if we can get into our next city. So this will be our way out. Otherwise we have to uh, go back the way we initially came to be able to get back to a town. So as you guys can see, we uh, got to the end of the road. We're here at the pavement section. So it looks like this is a success and we can get out this way when we try and leave tomorrow so now we're gonna see if we can find something cool oh we found something right off the rip oh it's a huge huge log pile that'd be so cool if there's some sort of enduro in here man oh this is a pretty little spot all right Woo! just did a little photo shoot sees up there and uh, yeah, so now we're just gonna kind of go exploring around the area. And I'm excited because uh, we're gonna be heading over to the dirt bike park tomorrow. We got two different dirt bike parks. We got one for each day. So that's gonna be epic, epic, epic. Super excited and stoked for that. But today we're just gonna get up to some exploring around and see what we can find around here. Holy shit. That was awesome! Wow, that was my longest wheelie ever. It wasn't awesome, like very good, but. Yeah, now it's starting to rain a little. Dude! Woo! That hill's awesome for learning wheelies. I gotta try that one more time. Whoa! 
The only thing that sucks about the carburetor is like, I don't know why, but it always wants to stall out after holding it up at that angle for a while. Obviously I know why, cause you know, it's flowing out the overflow and, but it just sucks. Need that EFI for that. I know you can totally do a wheelie with the carburetor. I know. No idea where this goes, but adventure baby. Wait up for the beautiful girlfriend. Starting to sprinkle a little bit. Well, this is gonna take us somewhere up and up and up. Oh! That was a big old gross boy. It'd be cool if there's some epic view or something up here. We are definitely getting up in the sky, that's for sure. So after a quick look at my map, we might be able to just ride this mountain all the way back over to our campsite. So I guess that's the exploring that we're gonna do now is see if we can take this to get down over that way. Okay, and all of a sudden we are literally in the freaking clouds now. We are in the clouds. This is crazy. Holy crap. We are up here. Jesus. This is pretty nutty. All right, well now we're up in these clouds, but looking at the GPS, it, we're starting to get way far away from where we need to go, so. All right, so we just got back from our little morning ride that we had there, and then we got some breakfast served up. We got some bacon, egg, Havarti cheese, some and some hot and spicy Gouda cheese. It's fire, I'm absolutely stoked. Let's get some breakfast, boys. Let's go. Oh man. Mm. All right, we just finished up camping at the river spot you guys saw us down at, and now we're back on the road, on the move again, off to find the next epic spot that we're gonna go ahead and check out. So now we're just gonna go ahead and rip along this dirt road down here, and uh, we're gonna head up through the woods somewhere and see where we end up, and I'll take you guys along for the journey with us. We were just like driving along this dirt road, and we just kind of saw this along the side of the road, so we'd stop and take a peek at it. Pretty cool little lake we got down here. Not gonna stay here, but it's a pretty cool spot. It's a little dock. Yeah, pretty cool little spot we found here. So, gonna keep adventuring on and see what we can find for the rest of the day. Find some more dirt biking. Hell yeah, it's raining right now, so hopefully that buggers off, but we'll see. So we've been out here driving for a couple hours now down this road, and then we just came across this epic spot. Look at this view. And it goes all the way down. See the water is way down there as well. But super cool spot in the valley. Oh yeah, I forgot to say, make sure you guys secure your load when you're going, cause literally I had one of the dirt bikes, one of the straps literally broke when we were ripping down the road and the dirt bike popped off, like broke off the trailer, the strap broke. And luckily, super luckily, the bike fell into the other bike on the trailer. So they fell into each other. So luckily didn't bounce off the trailer cause that would have been an absolute nightmare. The KLX would have went sending it off into the woods or into the ditch or off a cliff. So that was a close call. So, you know, that was, that was really interesting. Really close call, and then the trailer, the rear tailgate of it started popping out and bounced out because it's so friggin' bouncy on this road. So, yeah, you know, just gotta be extra careful. I was super sketchy, super glad the bike didn't go sending off into Narnia. But uh, yeah, so now we're just gonna go ahead, soak in this beautiful view we got here, and uh, I guess we're just gonna keep on mission her. Oh, and there we go, we arrived at our next destination. We got our truck all squared away. We got a little oasis here for uh, an evening or two, and we'll have some fun out here for a bit. And then uh, tomorrow morning, we're gonna be heading out and we're gonna be taking the dirt bikes over to the dirt bike park, which is gonna be super sweet. It's gonna be something new, completely new for Jess, and she's gonna love it, so I'm really excited to see what she thinks of it. So yeah, we're uh, gonna rest, chill out, chillax here for the rest of the evening, and just hang out, have a couple beers, make dinner, and all that fun stuff. So make sure you go down below, click like if you enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys subscribe for more. You're not gonna wanna miss tomorrow's ride. It's gonna be absolutely sweet, so I'll See you guys tomorrow. Peace out. Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to the channel for another video. Welcome back to the vlogs. Today we are back out. We are on the dirt bikes for today. We're out at Whiskey Creek. Gonna be absolutely sick. So welcome back. My name is Aaron. If you guys don't know, we're on this epic eight day trip. Now we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna hop on the racetrack and let's go for a hot lap, boys. All right, we're racing. On this, I'm racing myself. Try the other line over here. Oh shit, almost died. I don't know, how do you take these even faster? Woo! You gotta really jump it. Let's try and take the right side. Oh yeah, it looks like that's where the fast line is. Through there. Oh shit, get into this berm. Right out, we got the double. Oh yeah! My first jump's on the KLX. Jump the whole double. Woo! Oh baby! Come in hot, hard, quick onto the brakes. Rear brake up, swing in the ass end around. Come more, whoop, whoop, whoop. Hard right turn, come for down, come more. Get to this bank, hard on the brakes. Slide in the ass end around. Couple whoop, whoop, more bank, hard brake. Come in, 
Keep her controlled, hop, jump, hop into this berm. Over here, hard berm, jump her down, jump her, over, quick zigzag. Back on the gas, pop the front end, hard into this bank. Almost die off that, off that one. Come into here, death gripping a little hard. Switch to banks, over here more whoops. Trying to keep her together, over here. Tight by the tree, and that was a really, really quick lap around that course. Woo! After all that speed, I started itching for some hill climbs. We went over and found these bad boys. Yeah, baby! Woo! I wasn't so sure if I was gonna make this one, honestly. Holy shit! Holy crap. <laughs> oh my goodness. That gives you the pucker factor, all right. All right, so we are out in the dirt bike park. We're chasing down Jessica. And we'll see uh, kind of just like what, whoa, what kind of adventure we get into for today. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Looks like Jessica went and found us our first trail here. This is like her first real trails, which is exciting for her, I'm sure. Really getting into it. Oh boy. Woo! Looks like this is where they held one of their race events last weekend. <laughs> Pogo bumps. <laughs> oh, this is, yeah, see the mud hunty, mud honeys racing. We're on the racetrack. Yeah, Jessica, don't play no game. She's a mud, mud honeys today. She went straight for the racetrack. This is great. How many of you guys get to go out riding with your loved ones out on the dirt bikes like this? Like, I feel pretty lucky, pretty friggin' blessed, aren't I? Gotta definitely appreciate having someone like her to come out and do this kind of crap with me. Most girlfriends and wives just be like, yeah, screw you, get out there, go by yourself. I don't wanna go, I'm gonna go water the garden or something, you know? Mine's just like, no way, I'm coming with you. I want to ride too. I'm like, oh, hell yeah, okay. Hell yeah, thumbs up, let's do this. Out here, and that's why it's called Pink and Mud Honey. So let's take the bonus direct, bonus trail. Oh, I got a bug in my eye. Yeah, Jess, yeah, girl. Getting after it, she is. My turn. Popping <laughs> big old, whoa, big old wheelies. All right, now we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna grab lead here and we're gonna go ahead and set the pace for a little while and uh, let's go rip her down this trail, man. The trails here actually have like a really good flow to them and uh, the dirt's really well packed. There's a lot of momentum into these trails and it's a lot of fun of like zippy type trail stuff. So it's a good like beginner to intermediate area to be in and riding around, which was perfect for Jess. Consider this is her first time ever being at a riding park. Woo! This stuff is just a nice change up from my hometown. Oh, this is great. A lot less round rock and a lot more packed dirt. <laughs> this trail is great. So we just went through some of like the intermediate blue diamond stuff, a little bit, a couple green trails, a little bit of mud pit, little whoopy whoops over here and there. I had fun, so let's see what Jess thinks of it. Yeah, it was so much fun. We just ripped down all the intermediate trails in some of the, I think it was the race track. I think we did two, which I didn't even know they were racing tracks. So I was like, let's just send it. So we sent it up the first one, which was fun. I'm still getting used to like going downhill. It scares the crap on me because I had a fall when I was younger. So it's like still new to me. But other than that, it was like so much fun. And I loved all the little bumpy bumps and all the tree stumps, which were fun trying to get up those. Yeah, it was a little difficult to get up, but it was it was a great time. And it's so much fun just to kind of go fast and swerving through the trails. So yeah, it was great fun. Sweet. And it was pretty cool because there was sand here as well, which there's none of that here where I ride back at home. So that was kind of new to actually just like test out riding in a little bit of sand, which I've like never done before, which was pretty sweet. Oh, this trail is epic. This is called the Fast and the Furious. Oh yeah, that's awesome. Now that was a sweet, fun, sandy hill climb right there. I hear a Jessica coming. Yeah, yeah, woo! 
That was awesome. Now this trail is just a bunch of switchbacks going up and down this mountainside and it's just a really, really fun flow. Good, just good, oh, fun, cool. fast section. I guess that's why it's called the Fast and the Furious Trail. Definitely making Jessica face her fears of going downhill a whole lot. Oh, dude. This trail is so sweet. So much flow and fast awesomeness. All right, here we go. Oh! Whoa! Woo! <laughs> After watching that, I wish I just freaking sent it off that jump. I want to go back and hit that jump. Let me go hit it one more time. It's also hard when you have no idea around the corner, but that's what makes it so freaking exciting and fun when you're just flying around blind corners. Oh, that's sweet, man. Just an absolute little ripper trail. Oh, I love this. Woo! <laughs> That's awesome, dude. Man, there's such good banks and berms in here. You got nothing like this that's as smooth and as perfectly groomed where I live, that's for sure. This stuff is just like below for days. Pretty tight and twisty in here too. Yeah, this, uh, this is a pretty cool spot. You got this like, you got the highway literally right here. Got a whole lot of fun there at the dirt bike park. That was such a blast, like so much fun. A lot of fun ripping that like um, that little race course that we found with the jumps. Once you're able to clear those, that was just like super, super fun. And now we are here at the Qualicum Falls and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna check out, there is a waterfall here. So we're gonna go ahead and check that out, see if I can jump in it. Maybe I'll jump in the waterfall right now. If I can, if I can get access, if we can get to the bottom of it, I'm gonna go in it. So you will see if we can go in it. So let's go ahead, let's take you down to the waterfall and see what it looks like. Never been to it, excited to see what it looks like. So let's go. All right, and we just like that, we showed up Here's the waterfalls here. Got some down over this way. Come over here. Absolutely gorgeous, look at this. Beautiful waterfall, let me jump right in it. Let me get in that right now, boys. Oh, some beautiful white water too, man. Need it, gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme, gimme. Look at how freaking crystal clear that water is. You can literally see the bottom. It's so pretty, boys. I wanna go jump in it. There's goddamn signs, but there's friggin' signs everywhere that says absolutely no swimming, blah, 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 fines, blah, 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 blah. So I'm gonna go find somewhere else to go jump in. Like, come on, let me just go jump in that thing. Look how friggin' good that water looks. I just wanna dive in head first and get a concussion right off the rock. Like, come on. Well, it is an absolute scorch out there and unfortunately that stupid waterfall we couldn't actually get down to to like go on. Cause I don't know, just the stupid crap, you know, provincial park stuff. So we're back here, it is beer clock and it is time to go relax. We got a lake. There's a lake right over there. And we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna go jump in that lake and swim around here because it is smoking hot. So we're gonna hang around here, have some beer. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you go down below, click the like button, click subscribe for more. You're not gonna wanna miss out on the vlogs we got coming out. We've got lots of riding, lots of fishing, lots of kayaking, all that fun stuff coming up. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to the channel for another video. We just got the truck loaded up. My name's Aaron. We're out on this super crazy adventure going dirt biking and all this wild craziness. You guys are not going to want to miss out. So make sure you guys check out today's episode. It's going to be absolutely sick. Let's hit the road and let's get up to the next spot. Let's do it. We are here out at another brand new riding dirt bike park I've never been to. I'm super pumped. There's lots of hard trails, which is exactly what is like you guys know. My favorite trails are the hard stuff, the nitty gritty and down dirt, dirty and ditty. All that kind of fun stuff. Yeah, you know, you know, so I'm, I'm pumped. I'm jazzed up. I'm ready to rip and rock and roll. So let's go ahead. Let's hop on the bikes and we're going to get out there and get after it. So let's get to it. So if you boys know me, you know, I'm all about the, uh, the hard stuff. So this trail will lead me into a black diamond, which is the hardest trails they have here. We went and dropped Jessica off for a moment. She's going to sit and have a beer and chill for a minute and cool down. 
and I am gonna go find the hardest stuff here at the park. So let's go, uh, let's do some exploration and I guess I'm gonna see what I can find. Oh, is this the turn off down to the hard stuff? This looks like it's getting down to the, to the juiciness. All right, so this is the black diamond. Let's see what it's got to offer. Holy crap, okay. It's offering it so far. Oh yeah, this stuff is rough in here. I love it. Woo! Oh, it has been chewed up in here. Where the hell does this trail go? Definitely got more to it than the last one we were just on. This trail's got a lot more jumps, bumps, big boulders, and ledges to get over for sure. Yeah, baby! But I am absolutely loving the challenge and totally welcoming it. It's a great change up. Lots of roots. Lots of gnarly brocks in here. No idea what's around each corner. Which makes it real fun. Woo! This one definitely gets you death gripping, for sure. With all the round rock and loose rocks on top of the dirt, it just makes you really hold on really tight so you're not sliding off the bike falling over. Yeah, baby. Oh, wow. I love how much multiple choice you have for which trail you want to take. Oh, okay, I need to. My grip is death grip to hell. There's so many different routes and choices you have trying to go up so you can really just pick your own line and make it how you okay. want. Okay. Looks like the, the, the pussy route's on the right. We're gonna try this main route. We're here on the Black Diamond stuff, so I wanted to ride the Black Diamond Trail. I want to ride the hotter stuff. Damn, that is super duper loose. But this round rock riverbed ain't letting up on me and it is slippery as hell. There we go. Making some ground, but it ain't easy. Holy shit! Yep. Wow. Holy crap. Wow. This is definitely the black diamond. It's really nice to get back into some elevation. Holy smokes. The last dirt bike park we were at didn't have much of that. Woo! Oh my goodness. Wow, wow, that stuff's, wow. This trail's serious, holy crap. Wow, this trail's got it all right. Wow, okay, now this next section. Woo! This trail's a doozy. I am sweating bricks right now. This dirt bike park's sick. This stuff's real nice and tight, really narrow, right along a mountain's edge. It's pretty crazy and sick. This stuff is super loose though. Hard to get traction in some spots. Wow. Where the frick is this going? Okay, gotta try and release the hands. Release the Kraken. Release the hands. A little pop up. Yes! Oh my. Okay, this is quite a hill climb. Here we go. Nope, that was so bad, I almost ate shit. Okay, it's got a bit of a step up jump in the middle of this one. First or second? Let's go for second. Woo! Wow, holy crap. That is awesome. That is so awesome. Holy smokes, dude. Look at this downhill, boys. This is some steep stuff. I want to ride this trail now and go backwards through it and ride up all this stuff. It just looks like way too much fun. Holy moly, boys. This is one crazy little freaking trail, man. It's called the DNF. You do not finish. goodness what the heck man this stuff's insane holy crap yeah this park's got some hills to it for sure 
Wow, I'm impressed. This is so sweet. I really want to go back to this bike park. Super sweet. Look at this, this is like something out of a movie, boys. This is the same bike park. This is an epic little spot here, man. This is like something out of a, straight out of a movie. This is so cool. This is very, very cool. I'd love to come like, you can like camp here. Yeah, okay, this is really cool. This is really, really cool. I like this a lot. It's just, I don't know, something about the vibe here is just gorgeous. Woo! Oh, this is so cool. Why is this so cool? There's mud pits and just so neat to experience a new area like this. I just, it's just so cool. I don't know how else to put it other than it's just so freaking cool. Oh, she's making it. Close. Do you see how big of a hole you made? Yeah. You're not going anywhere. Let me get a good footing. And on the count of three, we're gonna go with lots of gas. You're not gonna flip. Three, two, one, go. Keep going. Woo! Yeah! Holy crap, that's a, a loose sandy hill. My turn. All right, here goes our first sand hill climb. Woo! Ew! I think with second gear you would have had it probably. Oh, I should do it again. Go down again if you want. Go, go, go. Gave her a red hot go. Mud pit, baby. First gear. Yeah. A little bit of mud adventure over here. Oh shit. I don't know about this. No, I don't want to get my boots wet for the whole rest of the trip. All right, so it looks like we're on what is known as the hardest, longest black diamond they offer at this riding park. So let's see what it has to offer and how much it can kick or not kick my ass. So let's, uh, let's get to her and let's test her out and see how hard it is or not. So far, it's pretty good, tight, instantly just technical. I have no idea what's around the corner or what we're doing for elevation or anything. Oh, we're going right, I thought we were going left. Where are we going? Okay, we're going up. Woo! Okay, wasn't ready for that. Big old cliff on my left. Do not want to fall down that. What a friggin' blast of an adventure so far we've been having here on this uh, dirt biking. Whoa, ex whoa! Extravaganza. Been a whole lot of fun. Holy crap. Woo! Oh, it's really hard to see now with this shade. Making your depth, for, whoa, hit the handlebar off a tree there. Climb over that log. It's tight and twisties here in the tree. Which way are we going? Oh, it looks like they both go the same way. Down this. Uh, we'll go this way. Yeah, we'll go this way. Woo! There we're going. Oh, we're right back up. Holy crap, those are some roots there, boys. Love it. Man, this bike park's awesome. Definitely makes it difficult though when you have no idea where you're going and there's uh, no flagging stuff here. It's just like, there's just trails. So you have no up, no notice of what's coming ahead. Okay, we're going into a, a river. Okay, river crossing into some very tight, muddy swamp, and up we go. Yeah, baby. 
this is sick. Where does it go? Oh, it goes straight? Yeah, straight. Then it goes right and left? No, that, it can't be that. It's definitely this one. Is it? No, there's no trail there. Oh, there is that a trail. I can't tell. I can't tell if that's a trail. This definitely looks like a trail. So we'll keep following this one. Here we go. Oh, up around that. Woo! Yeah, baby. God damn, okay. You got a rock garden they built. I mean, that's cool. That's cool. Well, I got mad death grip already. But I guess I have been out riding for like five hours. No, four hours. You can tell everyone's just come here and just sat there and just spun. And dug it all out. I'm assuming this is like where they had one of their race lines or something, right? Need to loosen my hands. They're just uber tight. You! Where are we going? I feel like this is... Oh, it is over this. Okay. And then where are we going up here? Going uphill here. Oh, we're just barely hanging on by the skin of our teeth. We're also doing the, the hardest, longest trail at the very end of the day of the ride. Oh, shit. What the heck? man oh wow that's a steep hill climb i'm out of energy oh my handlebar is stuck in this tree this is a huge rut they carved out right here holy crap holy crap oh this is a huge jump yeah okay heck yeah Made it up that. Wow, that was deep and intense. Jesus, Murphy. Okay, it looks like we're going back up again. And again, looks like people went up, got above that root. Oh, a tree fell. Oh, so they went around it. Oh man, this is freaking awesome. Okay, loosen up the hands. They're tight like a tiger, tight like a toidle. This is so cool. This is one hell of a trail. So very different from the stuff we have back at home. Like everything we have is all, um, it's all bedrock. This is like all loam, loam river rock. It's very cool. Very cool. Still doesn't beat the river or the, still doesn't beat bedrock, but it's dope. Makes me realize how lucky I am where I have to ride because I don't see the bedrock type stuff that we get like anywhere else. Okay, up we go. Oh, we were supposed to go up and left. I don't know why I had to th I thought I had to go up and right. Shit, just lost all my momentum. So it also looks like people hopped up here and then shimmied up this side too. I might be able to do, if I don't roll to my death down here, I might be able to get this like this and then pop up and dip left. Let's try. Just gotta watch your head on that tree. Oh! Okay. Okay. That was uber duber sketchy with the amount of wheelie we were going on with there. Then we come up, over, we cross up. I don't think I have the momentum for that now. We're gonna go up, cross over. Oh wow, man, this really does start being a black hard enduro, eh? That's so notched out from all these tires. Can we get up and over in that tree there? Okay. That was close. 
There's not much traction here, boys. This loam is so soft. Up we go. Yeah, baby. That was epic. That was epic, boys. Hell yeah. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you go down below, click that like button, click subscribe for more. We got banger videos coming out every single day. Stay tuned for more, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. All right, and just like that, we're at the middle of this random road here. And uh, yeah, I just found this spot on Trail Forks and it said there was dirt biking here. So we're here with the dirt bikes, got them loaded out. And uh, yeah, I guess we're just gonna hop on some trails and see where they lead us. Apparently there's some cool lake here. So we're just gonna see if we can go ahead and find that lake, it'd be super cool. I seen some photos that looked epic. So let's go ahead, let's hop into the trails and let's see if we can find this thing. Man, it's been five, this is the fifth day in a row of dirt biking. And I tell you what, it is catching up to me. My legs are like friggin' noodles today. I'll tell you what. Well, it looks like we're gonna be heading into the forest. This is cool. Like I said, I literally, this spot, I had no idea it even existed until I was just browsing trail forks and saw that it said that there was some dirt biking trails here. I don't know how legitimate they are because I know there's a lot of mountain biking here too, but this is very cool. It's like you're on a bicycle track, but it's for dirt bikes. It's so scenic in here. This is awesome. And the view I saw, I saw a photo online there of the lake. It looked very cool. So I'm excited to see what it looks like actually. Cause apparently it's like a beach. You can ride your motorbike right onto the beach, which is like super duper cool. Up we go. That's awesome. This is so like neat, man. I love this. It feels like where you just normally go for a hike in the woods, but you get to ride a dirt bike in it, which is awesome. I love this. Oh, there's some sort of big open something there. This is so sweet. Well, it looks like people don't come this way. It's pretty overgrown, so I don't think people are riding here that often, that's for sure. She's real bushy over in these parts. All right, now just kind of pop this out onto this road. I think the lake is somewhere over in that vicinity, so we're just kind of guessing how to get there at this point. A couple of whoopee whoop sections, and up we go. Okay, and now it looks like we're back, right back into the tight little woods. Super duper tight in here with overgrownness, for sure. But this is part of the adventure, right boys? Isn't this what y'all love? The pure rawness of adventure. We don't know where we're going or what's where, but we're just, we're just going, you know? No one's yelled at us or screamed at us they're doing something wrong, so I'll take that. And up we go. Awesome. I don't know which way we're supposed to go here. How you doing back there? Almost there. All right, now we're in the dark depths of the woods. Holy crap. Man, it's just giving you a whole variety of everything here. Eww! It's awesome, boys. Oh, okay, boom, here's the road. All right, back into the jungly depths here. This is just so cool. There's another trail up in there. There's quite a bit of mud puddles down here too. See the lake. I sees it. Woo! Holy smoly. This is so cool. Dude, this is epic. Oh, this is so sick. Oh, dude. This is sweet. Dude. Oh, yeah, dude. This is so awesome. Oh yeah, right here, look at this. Oh, this is magic. Hello. Oh, that's so sick. Look at that, boys. This is so bloody cool, guys. Look at this, boys. How friggin' sweet is this? So dope. So bloody dope. Epic. What the heck is this? Okay, some really old structure thing. Fancy. Interesting. I think we might make a change of plans and come camp here now. 
This spot's just so sick. I had no idea this was here, but man, is it ever cool. All the roads were gated in here, so you can't get a truck in here anymore. There's so many berms and jumps, and it's just like so fun and zippy, and just it's, it's just so flow. It's just it's awesome. It's so cool. I could pretty much spend all day here just playing around and messing on these berms. It's just it's just too much fun. It's just so much fun. It's awesome. Love it. Absolutely addicted to it. Want to go back right now. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> oh, it's like a little mini race course in here. I'm pretty much having the time of life like a child. Oh, this is so sick. Like, look at this spot. It's just like dreams here, boys. Definitely have to come here. This is so cool. Just like a mini race course all throw here. Epic burns too. <laughs> Woo! So much fun. Woo! Up along the ridge here. Ew! Off the ledge. Pull a hairpin back this way. This is so sick! Yeah, we need to figure a way in here with the truck, that's for sure. Hell yeah, boys! Alright, so this is the one black diamond they have here. So of course, you know, I had to come try it out and see what it's like. Just dropped off Jessica at the truck so she doesn't have to kill herself on this. So let's go for a little bit of a solo ride on this and see how hard this black diamond is. So far, it's looking pretty easy. Oh, it's, it's overgrown. What the hell is this? Okay, we're up. And up we go here. Tight and twisty. Real tight single track in here. No idea where we're going or what's in the trail when it's this overgrown, that's for sure. But it's gonna be down here. Okay, we're going right back up. really loose really really loose hill climb that's cool you can see the highway right from here such a random little spot for a dirt bike like tracks Woo! this black diamond is nowhere near the same as the other black diamond though but you can see this stuff's a lot more just uh where it's like in the dry powder Eww! sure is fun though through this really overgrown again can't see can't see uh oh blackberry bushes and then we're going downtown boys can't see a damn thing in the trail ooh ah ooh ah ooh ah ooh ah ooh okay here we go I'll back up yeah you can tell people don't ride the black diamonds here that's for sure they're goddamn overgrown but I don't think people are riding here all that much to begin with because most of the trails are fairly, fairly bushy. But man, that lake spot makes it all the worth it checking this spot out. That's for damn sure. That thing's so epic down in there. Lots of, lots of cool riding around here. Okay, here we go. 
up a good ledge. Up another one. Up and away we go. Woo! That was sweet. This is the other half of the black diamond. See what there is to offer in here. Oh wow, epic view, epic view boys, hell yeah. Woo! Tight and twisty. Whoa, big hole down that way. Woo! This is awesome. Down here, whip it back into the, whoa, almost wipe out. Back into the little woods. Up over the root. Up a little bit. Whoa! Bark Busters coming to the day again. Saving our butt. Down into the dark depths below. You know. Tight turns. Death grip is real. Face full of bush. Ow! Well, we finally made it somewhere after hours and hours of driving. And here we are at the ocean. We found a freaking ocean spot. And man, would you just, I don't know if you guys will be able to see us in the camera. Just look way back up in those mountains, man. Look at that. We're in the middle of summer and there's a mountain just covered in snow up there. So epic, so pretty. Huge, big old ocean spot. We've got our own little beach. We've got the rig parked up here. It's so, so sick. It's absolutely stunning spot. Super perfect spot. Super stoked on it that we finally found something after however many hours we were out driving on the dirt roads and trying to just find somewhere. Didn't have a bajillion people, so finally found somewhere. Super stoked on that. All right, and just like that, we dipped out from that last spot we were at. We're now at this random hole in the bush that we're gonna try and walk through. Apparently there's some caves here. So we're gonna see if we can get into the cave. No idea if this is the way, but we're going for it. We're sending it. So let's see what happens. Oh yeah, there's a trail. There's a trail up here. Oh, would you look at that? Like four trees fell right onto the bridge. Trees fell right on the bridge. So, that way or this way? Which way looks? Venture boys to find the caves. Would you look at that? There's another like nine trees down across it. I love it. Trees down here, trees down there. Hell yeah, brother. Gotta do a little dip of rooskies under the trees here. Again on this one, but this one's a little bit easier of a fit. Awesome, getting somewhere. All right, well, I think we found the caves here. Coming up on them, let's see. Oh, wow. Okay. There's the caves down in here. Okay, this is very cool. It's gonna be wet in there. There's a river flowing into the cave. So I guess he wants us to have three lights, hard hat, three people, no risk, suitable clothing, lots of time. We got none of those, let's go. Let's not die or run out of light. Da -da -da -da. This is cool, it's a serious cave. <laughs> the dark it is. Wow, it's a cave. Definitely should have brought a better real flashlight. Wow. I can't see crap. I almost stepped in a puddle. <laughs> that was close. Looks like it's dry right there. Meanwhile, it's water. Jeez. Yeah, slow down the steps here, boss. Whoa, giant cobweb. Crazy. Whoa. No, that's like crispy. There's a lot of loose rock. Whoa, okay, this gets real. Yeah, we're not set up to do this. I think this is probably where I stop. You can see we came in from up here. And I'm not sure that one. The ravine is going. Oh, you really can't tell, but like right about there is where it starts just being like a slide down the hill. Where you got all the water running down it. You can't really tell, but. 
Thank you guys so much for watching this mini series. I hope you guys have enjoyed the videos and hanging out with us on our massive long camping trip. This is a whole lot of fun. I'm really excited to get out and do it again. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys click that like button. It really does support the channel and helps us and it lets me know that you guys want to see more adventures and crazy fun stuff like that. So until next time, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.